Okay, welcome back. This time we are doing Rampage on the NES HDMI Kevtris. And this game is by Data East, just like Burger Time, which I just played. Very much enjoyed. And Rampage, unfortunately, I really don't enjoy it all that much. And before I get too far into it, I just wanted to tip my hat to a YouTube channel, Scottimus432. I'll go ahead and link his video in the description, but back in 2012, he did a deathless run of Rampage. This is a game that you actually can complete. It has 128 levels. And... He beat all 128 of them without losing a single life, which is impressive. I think his score was over 2,800,000. So good job, Scottimus432. I don't figure I'll be doing quite that well. This is a game that I certainly remember renting as a kid and being disappointed because you look at the cover art and it's great. It's King Kong versus Godzilla on top of the Empire State Building. Then you play it, and it's not so great. It's repetitive, very limited in what you can do. And it's not a very fun game to score chase. I will be doing some score chasing on this game here and there. It looks like the last time I played it, I only got 7,800 points. So clearly I have a lot of room for improvement. So we'll go ahead and jump right in, and we'll pick, we'll pick George, obviously supposed to be King Kong. Okay, controls certainly take some getting used to. And I think if you hit the toilets, it takes away life. Yeah, don't hold it against me. I am very much a at this game. But I did want to play it. Okay, and I think once the building starts to break on you, that's when you want to jump off as quickly as possible. like I already... I can't be right. Maybe my high score was 78,000. I have 7,800 written down, which seems really low. Pretty sure I made it past... I'm not even sure what all these power-ups that I keep getting are. I know that one was bad. The one that looks like the Punisher symbol.
and looks like I'm about to lose a life. I am still in Sacramento. Okay, get a little bit of life back. And I died. Is that all it takes? One life? Okay, so... I did not make it far at all. Looks like 23,400. Very weak score. As you can see, there's really just not that much to the gameplay. I will come back and score chase this at some point. Uh, the original graphics, because this was an arcade cabinet, I think it came out in 1985 or 1986, and it did look good, the arcade cabinet. I think it also had an extra character, a werewolf. Um, I don't know, on the NES, it just, very uninspired, lukewarm game. I will come back and torture myself with this game, just because I have a soft spot, even for mediocre games. Alright, so the copyright says 1986, Bally Midway, so I assume that the arcade cabinet came out in 1986. Um, pretty simple game. Maybe with uh, a little bit more time, I'll get better at it, but it's going to be a while before I come back to this one. So, anyway, a uh, pretty short video on it, too. So, hope you liked it. Um, stay tuned. Hopefully, I'll be playing something better.